Well, good afternoon and welcome to the Lord Life's Devotional here with Pastor H. And just about an hour away from our midweek service. And I'm always excited about gathering with my church family on Wednesday evening and enjoying the blessings of Wednesday evening uh, Bible study and prayer. And I always look forward to it. But anyway, I want to get this little devotional done, get it published here. So I'm going to move right along. I thought I'd just kind of share with you what we're going to be talking about tonight. Sure can't give you the full load on this little devotional, but to give you an idea of what uh, the people are going to hear when they come to church is that Jesus really does care. I think sometimes in light of the fact that our prayers are not always answered when we want them answered and how we want them answered, we may question sometimes whether well, the Lord really care. When we're going through some real heavy burdens, some real difficult times in our life, facing some severe problems, we may ask, does Jesus really care? Well, I can assure you that he really cares today. And what I'm going to talk about is that he really cares about our, about our physical needs. I'm so glad that uh, he doesn't want us to go around hungry. He doesn't want us to go without food and raiment and shelter. And uh, we know that he's promised that he would provide all of that. He said uh, in the Sermon on the Mount, the familiar teaching of Christ, that we're not even supposed to worry about what we're going to eat, what we're going to wear, what we're going to uh, find a shelter. He said that our Heavenly Father is going to take care of us. And the very fact that he's promised to supply all of our needs according to his riches in glory convinces me that he cares about our physical and our temporal needs and then I think he certainly cares about our spiritual needs how often we find ourselves uh, fighting battles that uh, we find ourselves insufficient uh, to really win the victory how often we go through some really di difficult places spiritually and I'm glad that Jesus cares and that he's promised that he would be there to fight our battles for us he would be there as a constant companion. And so he's given us so many promises concerning his presence in our life and uh, his power that will work on our behalf that we're convinced that he really cares. I know that he cares not only about our uh, physical needs and our spiritual uh, battles and needs, but he cares about our loved ones. We carry a heavy burden over our loved ones sometimes. We don't like to see our loved ones sick and suffering. We don't like to see our loved ones coming down to the end of life and, and facing death. Been uh, two, over two and a half years ago that I stood and watched my mother die. And, and uh, you know, that's a very painful time and, and a very lonely time. And we may wonder well, why is he taking our loved ones away from us? But he really cares. He gives us the assurance that death is nothing but the natural progression of life. We're all headed that direction. And uh, he told us that certainly he really cares about the, the pain that we bear when we're experiencing uh, the death of a loved one. Think about there's nothing to bring greater pain to a parent than wayward children, children that are not uh, giving their lives over to God and I'm glad that God really cares about that and oftentimes he just gives me the blessed assurance that he came to seek and to save that which was lost and I'm convinced he's out there doing that right now because he cares about our loved ones. He cares about our uh, physical needs, cares about our spiritual battles, cares about our loved ones, but all he cares most of all about us individually and about our salvation. He's not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. And, and there's nothing in the world that he wants any more than we should be saved, have the assurance of a place in heaven with him for eternity. And so knowing that uh, he cares so much about our personal salvation, he made a wonderful provision for it, forgiveness through the blood, He's given us a wonderful presence to go with us, to give us victory, to keep us on top. That's the blessed Holy Spirit. He's given us the many, many exceeding great and precious promises that by these we might escape 
the corruption that is in the world. So I'm happy to tell you tonight, Jesus really cares. He cares all about us. Lord, thank you for caring so much about us. We don't know why, but we know that you love us and you do care for us, and that's enough for us. Bless in the prayer meeting tonight, Lord. Continue to bless each one of our lives as we love and serve thee. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, thanks for letting me share that. I'll see you tomorrow here on the Lord Lights Devotional with Pastor Hayton. Goodbye now.